Sir Alan James Harris CBE, the 8th of July 1916 to the 26th of December 2000, was a British civil and structural engineer. Topic: <laughs> Early life and education. Harris was born in 1916 in Plymouth, and started working at the age of 16 taking evening classes in engineering at Northampton Engineering College now City, University of London. Topic career From 1940 to 1946 Harris served with the Royal Engineers as an officer in a port construction and repair company, landing at Port N. Besson in Normandy on D-Day Plus One. He was officer in command of diving on Mulberry B at Aramanches, working from a small fleet of French fishing boats, as a result of which he was awarded the Croix de Guerre. He later joined the Royal Engineers in the Territorial Army where he attained the rank of Colonel. After World War II Harris went to Paris to work for Eugène Freycinet, the pioneer of pre-stressed and reinforced concrete and in 1949 became Freycinet's representative in England. In 1955 Harris, his brother John, and James Sutherland set up the consulting business of Harris & Sutherland. Among other things, they designed aircraft hangars for Heathrow and Gatwick airports. Later, they expanded their work to infrastructure projects and had branches in Australia, Singapore and Hong Kong. Harrison Sutherland was acquired by Babtai, Shaw & Morton in 1997, and since 2004 has been part of Jacobs Engineering. Harris was a vice president of the Institution of Civil Engineers. He was president of the Institution of Structural Engineers in 1978 9 and was awarded its gold medal in 1984. Harris was appointed a professor of concrete structures at Imperial College London in 1973. Topic: Awards and honors. Awarded CBE in 1968 birthday honors. Knighted for services to civil engineering in 1980 birthday honors. The gold medal of the Institution of Structural Engineers in 1984. Hon DSC by the University of Exeter in 1984. Ordre du Merit of France in 1975. Topic: Selected projects. Pre-stressed concrete hangar at Heathrow Airport for BOAC maintenance headquarters 1950 to 55. Speakland Road rail depot. 